Hello guys, from today I'm making also videos in English. My name is Profesor Dot Ingeniero. Vale, okay. It's my Spanish English, it's my Spanish name, this one. So today I'm going to explain a polynomial factorization and I'm telling you a what's the goal of this uh, we factor factories factoring polynomials so uh, when we, we multiply together them we will uh, get the original ones okay the goal is to reduce uh, the polynomials to basic building blocks okay so the most important thing uh, you have to know is the the Ruffini's rule and I'm going to explain it, okay? For example, uh, we have this polynomial uh, P equals um, 2x5 minus, this is 5, okay? Uh, minus 3x3 plus 4x2 minus 9x plus 6 okay so how we ma make Ruffini's uh, to to factor factorize this polynomial the problem is uh, when we have uh, two great equations we can reduce them by the uh, two equations uh, to the two great equation solver is so so easy but with these ones is a, a little bit more complicated so we need to use Ruffini so how we do uh, how do we use Ruffini we need to to find a number okay which which works with this equation okay first we try with zero and we put zeros in the x Okay, zero minus zero plus zero minus zero plus six is not equal to zero. So zero is not an an, an solution of this problem. Okay, then we try with one. Okay, so two plus two multiplied by one is two minus three is minus one plus four is plus three minus nine is minus six plus 6 it's 0 so one solution of this equation is x equals 1 okay so you can you can try it uh, you will succeed if you try it so once we notice the uh, one is an uh, an solution of the the equation we just make this this table and here we put the coefficients of the polynomial First we put the coefficient of x5, the coefficient is this one, is 2. Then we put the coefficient of x4, we don't have x4, so it's 0. Then minus 3, then plus 4, then minus 9, and then 6. Okay, we put the coefficients of the, of the polynomial. Okay, then here we have to put the solution we found when we... Uh, try here the entire number. So we put here x1. If x would be 3, we, we, would, put, we would put here 3, okay? And the Ruffini rules uh, works like that. We take this number, the first one, in this case it's a 2, and we put an arrow down and then we put it here, okay? That's always like that. Then we multiply this by this. 2 multiplied by 1 is 2, no? Then we take this number from here and add this one here this plus this okay 0 pl plus 2 is 2 then multiply this by this again 2 multiplied by 1 is 2 then we uh, add this on this minus 3 plus 2 is minus 1 minus 1 multiplied by 1 is minus 1 4 minus 1 is 3 3 3 multiplied by 1 is 3 minus 3 minus 9 plus 3 is minus 6 minus 6 plus multiplied by 1 is minus 6 6 minus 6 is 0 okay we always uh, when make the Ruffini rule 
have to end with a zero. If this number is not zero, something is wrong. Okay, and this from here, uh, we will we are writing it again. Is this is two x four plus two x three minus x two plus three x minus six. You see this numbers here is this okay so it's a little bit s smaller than before because before we had an x5 and now we have the biggest x is x4 okay then we continue uh, with Rufinis we try another number here that uh, makes the equation work and if you try with one again it will work because 2 plus 2 is 4 minus 1 is 3 plus 3 is 6, minus 6 is 0, so we keep this number down, we put it here, then multiply, then we add, multiply, we add, multiply, we add, multiply, minus 6 plus 6 is 0, so it's, it's good, and now this is uh, 2x3 plus 4x2 plus 3 x plus plus 6 you see and now we continue with Rufinis we try another number now if you try with 1 it's not working because 2 plus 4 is 6 plus 3 is 9 plus 6 is 15 it's not working if you try with minus 1 it's not working too and if you try with minus 2 it will work okay uh, in this method, Rufinis rule, you always have to try until you succeed, okay? So now we try, try with 2. We put the 2 down. 2 multiplied by, by minus 2 is minus 4. 4 minus 4 is 0. 0 multiplied by minus 2 is 0. 3 plus 0 is 3. 3 multiplied by minus 2 is minus 6. 6 minus 6 is 0. zero. And then we get here 2x2 plus 0x, so we don't put it because it's 0, plus 3 equals 0, and because if, if we um, try to solve x from here, x is minus 3 divided by 2, uh, the squared, uh, oh sorry, I'm, I'm writing and you are not watching anything, okay. So, because if we try to solve this equation, 2x2 plus 3 equals 0, the x is the minus squared of uh, 3 divide, divided by 2, by 2. The problem is we cannot make uh, equations of negative numbers. Uh, we cannot make uh, squirtles of, of, uh, squirts of negative numbers, okay? So, we left it like this. So, w this is one solution. Another solution is x equals 1, another solution is x equals 1, because we had it twice here, twice, and the other solution is, is x equals minus 2. So how we write this? How we write this? We write it like this. We put the x with the numbers, okay, in the same side of the equal, okay, x plus 2 multiplied by x minus 1 uh, two times, okay, multiplied by 2x2 two plus 3, okay, and this equation is exactly the same as the one I wrote, wrote at the beginning, okay, if we would, uh, if we would work with this, we would, uh, we would uh, find the one I I wrote at the beginning, okay? So this is the Rufinis method. I hope uh, it worked for you and I'm making a very hard effort so I can, I can speak in English and try to help you with these uh, mathematics problems. Okay, best regards and hello.